Governor Greg Abbott is leaning into a rallying cry for conservatives. Something must be done to stop social media companies from censoring political views. KXAM Politics reporter John Engel finds out what Abbott wants to do about this, one of his top priorities, and if the problem even exists. Conservative speech will not be canceled in the state of Texas. Governor Greg Abbott believes Texans should be able to get back online if they're blocked or suspended for political views. And he thinks he's found a way to get around federal protections for social media companies. It would also allow any Texan who has been canceled or censored or deplatformed uh, to be able to file a lawsuit against Twitter Facebook or any of these other companies. Liberty. East Texas Republican Brian Hughes filed the bill in the state Senate. It says social media platforms are common carriers like cell phone or cable companies and shouldn't be allowed to restrict your service for expressing political or religious viewpoints protected by the First Amendment. And sadly, we have a handful of people in America today who want to control the town square. Roughly three quarters of Americans think social media companies censor political views. That's according to a Pew Research poll from last year. That includes 90 percent of Republicans. New York University researcher Josh Tucker says we don't really know if one side of the political spectrum is targeted more than the other because social media companies don't give researchers that kind of access. That the data we need to answer this and many other public policy, pressing public policy questions is now being produced by companies like Facebook and Google. Political science professor Brandon Roddinghouse says Texas Republicans will continue to hit these notes as the 2022 campaign cycle gets underway. There's no way the governor can distract from all of the crises that are facing the state right now. But this obviously does connect conservatives in a pretty significant way. John Engel, KXAN News. And the governor also faces criticism from fellow conservatives. New at six, a bold statement from Texas Agriculture Commissioner Sid Miller. The reason he says he's releasing his own power reform plan.